Hey guys, Nicholas Lott here with LB Altimeters. In this video, we will be talking about how to access and use the logbook functions of your Aries 2 altimeter. We'll start with how to view how many jumps you've made today. By pressing and holding the center select button for two seconds, the Aries 2 will display how many jumps you've made today or on the day of your last skydive on the main screen. To view the logbook on your Aries 2, use the access sequence by pressing and releasing the center select button and waiting for the lock icon to appear. When the lock icon appears, press and hold the select button until the lock icon disappears and then reappears. Then release the select button. The first screen of your logbook will display the number of jumps made on your last day of jumping. By pressing the top and bottom buttons, you can then scroll through the number of skydives made on each of the dates displayed at the top. By pressing the select button again, we'll now show you the total number of jumps logged on that device. Pressing the up and down buttons will again allow you to scroll through the jump numbers. To view more detailed information about a particular jump, assure that that jump number is displayed on the screen and press the select button to cycle through that jump's exit altitude, indicated by this icon, opening altitude, indicated by this icon, time in freefall, average freefall speed, indicated by the A, and maximum freefall speed, indicated by the M. The next screen displays your altitude profile, which allows you to use the top and bottom buttons to view that jump's altitude second by second. And the following screen shows you your speed profile, allowing you to see your speed throughout the jump. In order to exit the logbook function, just let it sit there. Just leave it. 15 seconds of inactivity on the Aries 2 will automatically exit the logbook function and return the altimeter to the main display. Or you can press the select button one more time until you see a flashing lock icon. Then press the up or down button to manually return to the main screen. If you'd like to learn more about the basic functions of your Aries 2, click this video here. Or if you'd like to take a deeper dive into adjusting the settings of your Aries 2, click this video over here. For more information on the Aries 2 or other LB products, visit lbaltimeters.com.